Yeah, you can basically just go crazy on the map. Like, what even is this anymore? Like, what game am I playing? <laughs> guys and welcome back to my channel today we have a cod mobile mod menu and before you guys spread hate i know a lot of people don't like hacking cod mobile i understand so if you want to dislike this video i completely understand i i, I completely understand i do not condone hacking this is completely up to you and you will get banned if you use this for a long period of time it's just how it is literally it's activision um depending on how good this anti-ban is We'll have to see how that works. But with this being said, guys, let's go ahead and get right into this. Um, so it's really simple. This one's actually very simple. And this is actually a Vietnam version. I know a lot of people wanted global and all that, which I completely understand. But for some reason, the mod creator has not made a global version. I think he's working on that. So as soon as that comes out, I'm going to make a video on that for you guys as quick as possible. But with that being said, guys, let's go ahead and get right into this. So the first thing you guys want to go and do, this is like so easy. Like this is way easier than it used to be. So basically, go ahead and install the APK, which is linked in the description. And then we're also going to have an OB file. Uh, which is also in the description. So originally in the past we installed the Play Store uh, Call of Duty and then we basically renamed, added a one, then deleted it and backed out the one. Yeah, all that. You don't got to do any of that just because this is Vietnam. I tried installing the Play Store version and then getting the Play Store OB from the United States and then installing a VN APK. Don't make that mistake. Simply just go ahead and install the OB and then go ahead and install the APK and i will zoom once that's done and i'll also leave es file explorer link in the description in case you guys don't have that and let's continue okay, guys the next step is once you open up any file manager i personally use es file explorer um, once you get into es file explorer just go ahead and swipe right go ahead and go to download and you want to go ahead guys and scroll down until you see cod mobile vn ob go ahead guys and click uh, click on hold it down and then go ahead guys and click more and then go ahead and click extract to then you want to go ahead and choose a path, go ahead and click on SD card, go to Android, and then you want to scroll down until you see OB, and then just click OK. I already have the OB as you guys can see, it's com.activision.callofdutyshooter. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and cancel it just because I already have the OB, because um, you know I have to test this stuff and make sure it works before I upload it, because I like to make my videos legitimate. Um, and then from there guys, once that OB is finally moved into the Android OB folder, just install the VN APK that I linked in the description and then basically load the game up and you're good to go. You basically have the uh, Vietnam mod menu for COD Mobile. So with that being said, guys, I hope you guys do enjoy. And if you do, leave a like. I'd really appreciate it. Subscribe and let's get right into this video. So I'll see you guys in the gameplay. Peace okay, out. Guys, so it also has a uh, login key. I'm going to actually paste this in the description so you guys can use this key or you can just copy it down from the video. And that way you guys can basically copy it down because you need this key to get into the mod menu. So go ahead, guys, click log in. And it's gonna go ahead and pop in, login success, welcome. So here it is guys, this is the mod menu, RH team. Looking very, very nice. And we have all kinds of great mods. I'm not even kidding guys. This menu has to be one of the best like visually, like it just looks so clean and just works very well. You are gonna crash, it is what it is. It is basically a COD mobile mod menu. So I did not mean to click get key, we're just gonna log in. Okay, there we go. So it will crash on you a couple times, just don't worry about it. If it crashes, just restart the game. I'm gonna get, no, I'm not gonna cut any of this. I want you guys to see basically like the playing experience because I don't wanna be the guy who skips, this, cuts it up and then you guys think it's fake because a lot of people call me out for that saying it's fake. It's not fake and people who say it's fake, does it, that make any sense guys? Like if you're watching this video, right? And you're seeing me right now, lively use, like right now, I'll click and close the mod menu. Like it's a legit thing. I don't know why people think this stuff's fake or staged. It's not fake. Like I know people have said that and it is, but like, I don't, I don't review fake stuff, trust me. So, yeah, this menu is really cool. Um, actually, I've, and also you're gonna have to download like a ton of resource packs, all kinds of stuff to get into the game, which is normal because, you know, you gotta install the COD Mobile updates, you know, a lot of stuff to install. This is a huge game after all. Um, any second now, it should load up. There it goes, starting to load up. Okay, and this also is in a different language. Just wanna go ahead and say that right now. This is in a different language, and the best thing to do is follow my instructions, and I'll show you guys how to change your language. A lot of people can't read this, and they're gonna be very confused, so. This is taking a while. I know I said I wouldn't cut it out, but this is taking a very long time. Okay, there we go, finally. I was gonna say, I was about to have to just cut it because it was taking so long. I don't wanna get, make you guys bored. All right, let's get into this mod menu. Let's do it. All right, so I've already done the tutorial because I tested this mod menu out earlier. 
But I want to show you guys how to change the, uh, actually, I think he's going to do the little tutorial. Yeah, he's going to do it. Okay, so we'll just do this, blah, 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 blah. Okay, we get it. I think this is where we upgrade it, I'm pretty sure. Click on it, upgrade, back, back, okay. Multiplayer. Okay, let's see if I can change the settings. Is, is it gonna, like, can I resist this? Okay, I, I guess it's making me play the game. That's fine. Cause like right now, I just wanna show the gameplay. Well, I'll show you guys how to do this after the gameplay, by the way. So if you guys wanna skip through the video to see how to change the language, then that's fine. All right, boys, so here we go, we're in the game. And before we start, let's go ahead and uh, change up the, the uh, language. I think it's, where's it at? Oh, here we go. All right, so if you guys wanna change the language, go ahead, guys, and click settings, like that, the little settings icon, and click on the second from the bottom one and click English, then click confirm, boom. Uh, anyways, we're, we're here for the moment, not like freaking language, whatever, guys. I don't know what to do about it. Speed hack, jump hack, so let's go ahead and check this out. So as you guys will see, you're running a lot faster and yeah, you're jumping a lot higher too, which is really, really cool. Uh, and you can like basically zigzag. These guys won't want to kill you. It's really cool. These are bots so anyway. So like if you start out and you somehow don't, if you do, somehow don't get banned, either way, you're going to be playing with bots. You're not really affecting anyone's in-game experience, to be honest with you. Um, but if you guys can somehow get to the point where you're not getting banned, that's really cool. Uh, and let's go ahead and check out the visuals. So we have ESP Lon, ESP Box, ESP Health, ESP Radar, and Champs. Uh, Champs, epilepsy warning, that's all I'm going to say is huge epilepsy warning because it gets pretty crazy, honestly. I'm not going to lie, guys. Like, it, I'll just show you guys. But if you have epilepsy, this is a warning. Um, but yeah, you can basically just go crazy on the map. Like, what even is this anymore? Like, what game am I playing anymore at this point, guys? Like, what am I playing? Um, anyways. Let's go ahead and turn all that off because that is crazy and noisy. I uh, can actually change your ESP colors if you want to, as you guys can see, it changes the colors to whatever you want. Uh, I think yellow looks cool, but I actually, no, let's get all green. I like green. Green looks more like a hacker color, I guess you could say. Radar range, that's really cool. Radar size, you can actually increase your radar size and your dot size. So it actually shows exactly where they are. And then we have the aimbot menu, the notorious aimbot menu. So if we use this, we close it. Oh, we already won the game. Oh, well. Okay, right, guys, so it's pretty much starting this game up. Actually, there's actually a ESP box like filter. You can change it between stroke, field, corner, rounded, and 3D box. So let's try field. Oh, okay, let's okay. I, I see what that means. So basically it fills up the uh, box like that. So aim FLV, guys, it's actually really crazy because like, look at this. It's actually locking onto them. And basically what this does is it doesn't aimbot towards them until you like see them like if you're close to them which i think is really really dope there he is got him got him got okay our game's gonna crash oh no it's not gonna crash okay good so basically it's kind of like a very hidden aimbot i guess you could say if you guys want to kind of like hide it i guess but honestly really really cool honestly look at that dude all right so from here let's go ahead and turn on the aim at distance and basically what this is going to do is make it to where you aim at this person no matter what and you can just sit here guys like look how strong the aimbot is on this game um, this is VM, by the way. I don't think I've ever got banned on Vietnam version of COD Mobile. Like, I'm not even playing, guys. Like, I've never got banned on COD Mobile on VM. I have been banned on Global, probably because I'm from, I'm um, probably in their server, like, in the location of where their servers are located. Um, but this is just really crazy. I do recommend using a VPN either way because, you know, if you really don't want to get banned, I definitely recommend using a VPN. But just saying, for me, I haven't used a VPN and I'm, I mean, I'm doing, I'm kind of chilling right now. Like, honestly, I've been kind of using this for like about probably 10, 30 minutes and I'm not, I'm not getting banned. So, I mean, you know, it is what it is. Uh, yeah, yeah. I don't really recommend using distance aimbot as, as overpowered as it is. It, it kind of just messes up with your gameplay. Like you can't really control your character as much anymore. Like it gets a little crazy, honestly, but it is very overpowered. That is for sure. Like, look at this. Okay, he's, this is front line, so you're not gonna get like the best consistent spawns, like, you know how it is. There we go. Uh, I'm not gonna be able to kill these guys. <laughs> like, they're all just spawning in crap. I'm just gonna turn this crap off. This is so overpowered. Uh, then we also have aim checking. So basically, if you're shooting, the aimbot will work. So in other words, let me pick up a assault rifle. 
and basically it doesn't work until like you're shooting at person so basically shooting at it boom it draws right to it shooting at it boom draws right to it it's pretty cool honestly and then from here guys what else do we have we also have the oh you can actually set it to where like what you want to shoot it at so like if you want to shoot all headshots or a headshot camo or whatever you can do that and if you just want to hit all uh chest shots you can also do that as well but man honestly I love, I love recording COD Mobile videos just because I generally enjoy the game. Like, you know, a lot of games that I make, I just don't really, like, have any interest for. But, like, this is one of the games that I've, like, played to the end. Like, I've always liked COD Mobile. And actually, I'm actually a legitimate player. Um, the only time I hack ever is when I record videos. Like, that's literally it. That's the only time I ever hack a game is when I'm recording videos. I never use hacks outside of any of my videos. Just because I like the satisfaction of earning things legitimately. And I take more pride in the things I earned from playing legit. But... There are other people out there that like to just get everything for free. And I completely understand because a lot of these games have a ton of grinding in them. And other people just don't feel like wasting the time and do that. Which I completely understand. But personally me, I'm more of a legitimate legitimate player and only hack in my videos. So before you guys spread hate in the comments, I know this video is going to get a lot of views. Okay, This is the COD Mobile mod menu. It's going to get a good amount of views. And for the people that want to hate, I understand. Like I completely get it, guys. Uh, me hacking your favorite game. I mean, why would you like that, right? But I just want to go ahead and say this right now, guys. I do not promote or encourage hacking. This is just for entertainment purposes only. And yeah, that's basically it. I don't know what else to say. Well, that means that, guys, that is basically the end of this video, guys. Thank you all so, so much for watching. And I'll see you guys, of course, in the next Mod Mini video. Peace out.